you got to make sure that people don't uh, run reds here they are notorious in this area for running reds here's the MGM casino and we are just gonna cross over the Woodrow Wilson Bridge like uh, playing Russian roulette you still need to be like paying attention to your six here because people will fly by you and they want to cut you off it's the Woodrow Wilson Bridge and this is my favorite park it's an amazing park it really is and it's kind of like a big huge parking lot here there's group rides or cycling that happen here I think it's on Tuesdays and there's bathrooms public bathrooms that's always nice and here we go look at that it's a cool cool look this is a bike trail so I use this quite often so I come here a lot Oh, I should take a bike, uh, like a photo of my bike. I think I'll do that. Hold up. Yeah, I think I'll stop here. It kind of goes around and around. I, I like it. It's really one of the better parks in the area. Nice little break here. You know, I kind of like to snake around here, so let's just go around and look at this these houses. I mean, that's a one house and it's huge. They have a, a Tesla Model X and they don't even have it covered up. It's just, it's bonkers to have a $120,000 car outside. You know, that's how much my house costs. Large townhouses, or I guess you could say they're row houses. And like single family homes mixed in here there's people who are uh, completely separated from other people some people even have like blocks you see this house this house here and then there's that section over there that's even it's like a community closed off look at this house you can barely even see but it belongs to this one you see it's a single family home and it's huge so you know it's an amazing area these are single-family homes they look like row homes but they're not and you can see the water so if you have a house here you have the view of the Potomac yeah these houses are really kind of fascinating because they're newly developed look at all the snow man that's a lot of snow just jogging with a mask you don't need to buddy it's kind of crazy all the restaurants put this used to be where the uh, the art league was it was a big warehouse and they built a stupid hotel just ridiculous that was actually one of the better parts about old town is that they had an art school it was like really grungy and then they removed it stone road cobblestone road and it is rough on a motorcycle or bicycle you go through there it shakes your entire body and see nobody's around but this area gets a little bit more packed than DC because they are opening up everything the torpedo factory yeah one time they did build torpedoes here but now it's more of like an art center and you know the weird thing about art is that it's basically just a bunch of like old ladies who have a lot of money and their husbands work and then they have studios there because it makes them feel like artists but one thing I like is this like the uh, grunginess and like an industrial area added into this really expensive area and the interesting thing too about Alexandria there's the bicycle trail the interesting thing about Alexandria is that it's got like what do you call it those homes for like poor people like this right next to million dollar homes it's so strange and kind of interesting like these homes they're the low income housing you see how badly taken care of them? and then you see in the background these million dollar homes look at that terrible area and then this chunk here is all just like these really terrible areas 
10 years ago, 20 years ago, it was even worse. Look at this dork. I'm gonna wait until he, he comes. <clears throat> oh, that is so dorky. The lip to go. Oh, that is so dorky. Alexandria's got a lot of white people. Oh, wow, this is like brand new. They, they completely developed this. Like, while I was taking a nap, they like... Row House, the Pet Wellness Store. Ah, oh, that is so like Old Town Alexandria. Oh, what is going on here? God, I hate it when they make U-turns in the middle of the road. Man, what is this? Sister 2? Sister 2, what is that? St. Elmo's Coffee Pub. Woo Boy Hot Chicken. Oak Steakhouse. This is like the type of trendy looking stuff that you see in DC popping up. But it's completely empty. But I think I'm gonna go straight this time. Hank. Hank and Mitzi's Italian Kitchen. Hmm. I guess I'll go to the right. You know, the interesting thing about this road, this is uh, the GW Parkway. If you look straight ahead, right in front of this road, it goes from GW. GW stands for George Washington. And this road just goes forever. And look at that, you have a Washington Monument just sticking out of that road. You know, we see the Washington Monument from Alexandria, Virginia. And it goes from like George Washington's house on the George Washington Parkway. There it is in front of you. That is the development of Amazon HQ2 over there. That the shit building that everybody. I I like the shit building that Amazon is building HQ2. I have plenty of time. Look at these geese. These geese are assholes. Just hang out over here, and then the airplanes fly really low, and they land over there, and. You know, there's been a couple of cases where airplanes have actually missed the runway and they have gone into the water. I think I remember two occasions. I was not here for that. I think this was like in the 80s. One was in the frigid winter and it actually missed it by a long shot. And it ended up in the Woodrow Wilson Bridge around that area. And like there was like people freezing to death. And then another one was right over here somehow. I don't know what happened. Look at the amount of land that's here. And if you look over there, that is DC across the bridge. That's the Capitol. That's the Washington Monument and the Jefferson Memorial. That's the water treatment plant. So if you go that way across the bridge, that's actually Maryland. There's an helicopter. The interesting thing about this area is that there's a lot of uh, airplanes and helicopters especially that fly overhead but they have to fly in certain areas so they usually like the route it takes is over the water just in case they they have to crash there's an helicopter actually coming over there and another interesting thing is that the Pet Pentagon is here so sometimes you see the helicopters going into the Pentagon there's one particular airplane that's so badass it's a airplane slash helicopter called the osprey and you see it fly and just kind of like land at the pentagon and you see this all from the road and sometimes you see like f-16s especially if there's like a weird thing happening i remember there was a airplane a guy that didn't have clearance <clears throat> to fly and they scrambled jets and then you saw these like fighter jets all over because remember DC as much as you think it's like all political most of DC is um, like military bases there's like all of these bases near here and there's so many people that just work in these bases what do you think the chances are of a guy like you and a girl like me ending up together <laughs> I'm kind of stuck here. The cops won't bother me. 